One of the things about Paper Man is I knew, I always kind of knew that it was going to be in black and white, and I knew I wanted to be in Manhattan around 1940, 1950, because that's this kind of like shining moment for this great American city of like really bursting with life, and, and um, it just felt like a really magical time. I wanted it to be a rich, like dimensional world that you could feel like you could reach into. I didn't want it to be super flat. And this is something that John Lasseter pushes for a lot. He wants the audience to trust that that world is out there. He doesn't want you, he doesn't want to break the spell. He doesn't want you to be pulled out of the, out of the storytelling experience. He just wants you to be immersed in that storytelling. And I, I believe that there's a way we could do this that had a stylization to it that did have that rich dimensionality, that rich tonal scale, and that did have this feeling that you could reach into that world and still feel like something fresh and new.